Mr. Clark and then Madam Lynn. Thank you, Madam President. Uh, two points, if you please. Uh, firstly, in Amendment 6, which we shall vote on later on this afternoon, it says, emphasizes that some member states already have excellent security mechanisms in comparison to international and European level. I shall support that very happily, and I will suggest to you that it goes right to the heart of safety of off offshore installations, so much so that it represents best practice. And surely, in the EU, you should be taking best practice from wherever it comes. Uh, and that being the case, why do we need all this complex new directive? Why don't we just take what the best practice is on offer, amend as necessary, and there we are. It, there's no need to reinvent the wheel. My second point is, comes direct from the original uh, script, paragraph sev 7. Calls for companies based in the EU to apply the same work and health safety rules in all their operations around the world. Well, I'm very sorry to be cynical, but I can foresee that some such companies will therefore relocate from Europe and take advantage of the perhaps lower standards elsewhere in the world in order to continue their business and remain competitive, in which case when that happens, they will of course take their business entirely from the EU and we will lose all the company profits and taxes which derive from it. It's called shooting yourself in the foot, and therefore we'll think that's a thoroughly bad idea. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you. If no one else wishes to take the floor, I'll respond to the comments now. I'll start with Mr. Clark's comment on best practice. Well, the point of this revision is to... Uh, look at existing best practice so I, I don't think that uh, I think we've taken your concern into account here now on the uh, behavior of our companies abroad we feel that we we need to be consistent we can't we can't um, say that we're in favor of achieving the Millennium Development Goals and then um, behave in a way that's not consistent with our ideals outside the EU. So I think that is an important aspect of the opinion. I, I, I do hope that the majority will be able to support that idea.